Hello there, my name is Jason Perkins, and I want to welcome you to another episode in my Georgia Workers' Compensation video series. I'm an attorney who specializes in handling Georgia Workers' Compensation cases. I created this series of videos because I wanted to provide people who have been hurt at work with helpful information about Georgia's Workers' Compensation Law, the rules of Georgia's Workers' Compensation, and the benefits available to them under Georgia Workers' Compensation if they're hurt at work. Today, I want to talk to you about one particular part of Georgia workers' compensation law, and that's whether the workers' compensation insurance company will have to pay for medical bills. The basic answer to that question is yes. One of the three basic benefits covered under Georgia's workers' compensation law is payment for medical treatment and testing for your injury. Workers' compensation covers it 100%. That means there's no copay or deductible um, for your medical treatment. So it's different than like your group health insurance where a lot of times you'll have to pay some portion of the medical bill, either a percentage or a copay when you go and get treatment with a doctor. It's covered 100% under Georgia workers' compensation. But there are a couple of limits that you need to understand on that workers' compensation coverage. The first limit is you can't just go and see any doctor that you want and have workers' compensation pay for it. Under Georgia's workers' compensation law, you have what's called an authorized treating physician. Um, that's basically your main workers' compensation doctor. You can treat with your authorized treating physician for your work injury, and workers' compensation will cover it 100%. Your authorized treating physician can also refer you to another doctor, and the treatment with that other doctor will be covered. But if you just go out and see any doctor that you want to, then workers' compensation is not necessarily going to have to pay for that treatment. Um, so you need to be sure that the doctor that you're treating with in your workers' compensation case is an authorized doctor. Because um, if they're not, then your treatment may not be covered. The second important limit to understand about workers' compensation's coverage for medical treatment and testing is it doesn't just go on forever. Um, in most cases in Georgia, your workers' compensation medical treatment and testing is limited to 400 weeks from your date of injury. Now, there are a couple of exceptions to that. If your case is designated as catastrophic under the workers' compensation law, then there's not a 400-week limit on your right to medical treatment. Also, for certain types of medical treatment, durable medical equipment, um, spinal cord stimulators, intrathecal pumps, and um, prosthetic devices, the 400 week limit will often not apply. But in most cases, you're going to be limited to 400 weeks, which is a little bit more than seven and a half years of medical treatment for your injury. Now, that's often not a concern because most of your medical treatment and testing is likely to have occurred before you hit that seven and a half year limit on your medical treatment. Um, so you may not have to worry about it. But if you do continue to need medical treatment for your injury past 400 weeks, then workers' compensation may be off the hook in the future if your case is de not designated as catastrophic or the medical treatment is not one of those three exceptions that I mentioned to you earlier. I hope you found this information about whether workers' compensation will be responsible for payment of medical bills helpful. If you have, please let me know that. The best way that you can do that is by liking this video or giving it a thumbs up. If you want more information about Georgia workers' compensation law, you can visit our Perkins Stutter Workers' Compensation channel on YouTube. You can subscribe there to be notified of my future videos in the Georgia Workers' Compensation video series as they come out. You can also visit our website, which is www.perkinslawtalk.com. Uh, there's helpful articles about workers' compensation there. And you can also set up a free consultation with me if you've got questions about workers' compensation that you want to discuss. Just complete and submit our free consultation request form, and someone from our workers' compensation team will reach out to you to get a consultation scheduled. You can also uh, set up a consultation by calling our office at the phone number on the screen and someone from our team will be happy to schedule a consultation. I'd like to thank you again for watching this video today. I want to wish you the best of luck as you recover from your injury.